everybody, Jason here of GhostbustersNews.com, and as always, Ghostbusters News right here on YouTube. And in case you missed it, earlier this morning, Empire Magazine gave Ghostbuster fans another sneak peek at the upcoming November issue. Which, if you're keeping score at home, that issue arrives on newsstands this coming Thursday, September 30th. So yeah, this morning's sneak peek, it featured a few excerpts from the interview from father and son director duo Jason and Ivan Reitman. Of course, Ivan Reitman, director of both Ghostbusters and Ghostbusters 2. And then you have Jason Reitman, director of the long-awaited Ghostbusters Afterlife. The third installment to the original Ghostbusters franchise. Now, as part of the interview, you're seeing it right here on your screen. Empire did give fans a glimpse of the photo shoot taken for the magazine. Once again, featuring both Jason and Ivan Reitman, with the photo shoot taking place on the Sony Studios lot in Culver City, California. Now, following this morning's reveal, Ghostbusters Afterlife director Jason Reitman took to social media, posting, Thank you, Empire Magazine, for this moment with my father. I've said from the start that Ghostbusters Afterlife feels like getting the keys to the car. To quote Rob Brydon in The Trip, You're stuck in a metaphor. Thank you, Dylan Coulter and Kristen Shaw, for making us Reitmans look coolish while leaning against a classic car when our natural habitat is huddled over bags of popcorn. Now, in addition to reposting the image from that Empire Magazine article, Jason also shared this image of him alongside his father, once again, director of both Ghostbusters and Ghostbusters 2, Ivan Reitman, on set of the original 1984 film. As both Jason and Ivan have admitted in countless past interviews, the whole process of making this film has been rather emotional, and in an excerpt of that Empire Magazine interview, Ivan Reitman admitted to becoming emotional when hearing his son's pitch for the film. It just took my breath away. I literally cried. I even cry right now when I start to think about it. It was a very emotional experience. Now for those that missed our coverage from yesterday, Empire Magazine also gave fans a new look at the brand new team of Ghostbusters. We've got Lucky played by Celeste O'Connor, Trevor played by Finn Wolfhard, Podcast played by Logan Kim, and Phoebe, played by McKenna Grace. As well, we also received this up-close shot of Muncher, a newcomer to the franchise, and someone or something I cannot wait to see more of when Ghostbusters Afterlife arrives in movie theaters exclusively on November 19th. Now, as I mentioned at the top of the video, if you would like to grab the brand new November issue of Empire Magazine, it will be arriving on newsstands this Thursday, September 30th. If you'd like to go ahead and pre-order your copy, we do have that information and it can be found right down below in this video's description. That's all I've got for you here right now. As always, be sure to subscribe to Ghostbusters News here on YouTube. Bust that bell notification icon to stay up to date with everything that's happening within the Ghostbusters world. If you'd like to join up with Ghostbusters News, check out our Patreon page. We have a link to that down below in this video's description. And I'll see everybody right back here next time.